Hey everyone, this is the Skiing Cartographer here, and today I'll be taking you on a full tour down the slopes of Cataloochee Ski Area in Maggie Valley, North Carolina. In this video, you'll see the top to bottom of every trail on the mountain, and at the end, I'll give you my one minute review of my days here. But let's go ahead and jump into the skiing. Here are the timestamps for every run, which are linked in the video description below. We'll start with upper oh my gosh and make our way clockwise around the mountain. Enjoy!
Thank you so much for watching. I had the chance to visit Catalucci Ski Area over the course of two days in January of 2024. While I had wildly different experiences each day, I had a great time skiing here. The first day I dealt with single digit temperatures, closed runs that were open the day before, and lots of snow guns, and the second day I dealt with rain and fog. But that's just part of skiing in North Carolina. Overall, I was very impressed with the snowmaking and grooming, even with the occasional patch of ice. I think Catalucci has a lot to offer for beginners, along with a little more of a challenge for advanced skiers than other mountains in the region. As an advanced skier, the main run of Upper Oh My Gosh through Rock Island Run to the bottom was my favorite both days, with Alley Cat acting as a nice change of pace run. I wasn't as impressed with Snowbird, as it was even tighter than I would have guessed from the trail maps and webcams, and the train park is definitely a little lacking. With that being said, this mountain is definitely tailored more toward beginners, and Catalucci provides a nice variety of runs and a quality ski school for those just starting out. The resort does have the standard amenities, and while I did think it seemed a little dated, I also think that's part of its charm. It has an old school feel and some nice decor to go along with it. I will say they definitely need to upgrade their Wi-Fi, which was spotty at best and non-functional at worst on both days that I visited, especially since there is very poor service on the mountain. Also, they don't sell Catalucci stickers in the ski shop. What's up with that? Overall, I had two really good days skiing Catalucci. If you want to check out the mountain for yourself, a link to their website is in the video description. Thank you so much for watching my video today, and I look forward to seeing you on the mountain.